July and it's the 3rd of August at last, it's voting day. We are up here at Hibiscus Retirement Village and it looks like it is the, probably one of the most well-organized election days that can be possible. No queues, it takes you less than five minutes. Brilliant, well done. It, it was very good, no hassles, very quick, can't complain about anything. Chop chop. How long did it take you? Five minutes. Not even. We walked in straight through. Organisation this year? Better than the last time, yeah. Are you expecting long queues? Mm, well, no, hopefully not, yeah. yeah. We'll see you when you come out. Okay, thank you. Who was the owner of the Yeah, the was very my very good, very professional, and very good in and out. Very happy. Hats off to the IEC this year? Yeah, I think they did a good job. Tell me, did you have to stand in a long queue? No, I only took five minutes. The experience was very good, it was very good. The service and people, yeah, it was very good. Do you think they were well organized this year? They were very well organized and the place is very beautiful. Only like three minutes in and out. Yeah, very quick. Impressed? Yeah, very impressed. Yeah. We are here by Ramskite, by Wijksafdeling number 2, here by the Rema Kerk. Um, we have a very good uh, finnige stem process. Everything is seep glad for you. I think the Unafhankelijke Verkiesingscommissie has done a lot of good work. The forums are on date, everything is on date. Uh, South African police dienses op op die plek en hulle doen hulle werk uitstekend en baie dankie vir die kiesers wat wel hulle steun kom gee het aan die verkiesing en deelgeneem het aan die lokale munisipale verkiesing. Alles van die beste. Quite uh, well organized. I've come all the way from Port Edward uh, on a motorbike and I uh, got you walked straight in, voted and walked out. Very well organized, I must be honest. Compared to the previous years where I've stood here since five thirty in the morning to be first in line, this year has been an absolute pleasure. You get to vote on your birthday. Did they I give got, you two votes? Yes, I did, ma'am. I got three papers, matter of fact. <laughs> How was the experience this year? Great, smooth. I think it's very smooth. Spoken to a lot of people. They say everything is running great. Quick. Uh, you just go in and go out. It's very quick. Impressive. Yeah, very, very impressive. Uh, don't, there are no delays. It was wonderful. Very friendly. Really appreciated it. Dave, we had Ramsgate Voting Station today. It looks pretty impressive. How have the queues been here this morning? Well, we had an amazing thing this morning. At half past six, the queue was right outside into the street here. So, of course, everybody came here early to beat the queues. Meanwhile, that was when the big queue was. But there's a good atmosphere. They've had a couple of people grumbling about the queues. Most people, really, it's democracy and they're quite prepared to be patient. The queues are moving pretty fast inside today. Um, things look like they've taken an upturn in terms of IEC's organisation. Very much so. The PO here is, a, is really professional. And this one, similar to most of the voting stations that had more than a thousand voters, they've created multiple lines. So you've got like two substations in there. So um, that is literally double the time. You know, I mean, half the time that they've taken. No, it's, it's a welcome improvement. This used to be chaos here. You've been around to a few of the other voting stations as well. How's it been out there? It's been very well. Now, it's going well all over the place. We had, that's one of the problems, we had to go and sort out some hassles. We had one voting station where they failed to seal the ballot boxes and there's another one where they weren't stamping all the ballots and we had to get the Hawks involved, but it's all been sorted out and the IEC has been very helpful and they've really acted quickly as soon as we've noticed major contraventions like that. The IEC has acted very quickly, I must say. A lot of confidence in their ability to handle it. Were you aware that SAPS had taken the decision that there would be no photographers or videos in the voting stations itself? That I wasn't aware of, certainly from the press side. From our side, I know they changed the Municipal Electoral Act where they forbade any taking of photographs inside, but that was meant to be voters. And interference in press freedom, is that, that's something that was new to me. But certainly we had the thing last year where people were taking camera voting photographs of their vote. Now that wasn't then illegal, it just wasn't defined. Now it's illegal. So there was the press, the police will arrest anybody they see taking photographs inside. But to actually interpolate that to being an interference in press freedom, that's a worrying trend and I'm definitely going to report that to our municipal electoral officer now and say the press has been interfered with. Dave, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. I hope the rest of the day goes as well as it's gone so far. Absolutely. And it's winds blowing and it's a sunny day and yeah, democracy in action. I love it. Thank you. Thank you.